12 hours, a barge sat stuck on the Mississippi River, crashing into a lock and dam there. It happened in western Wisconsin in the tiny town of Alma. That tugboat lost control in the strong current of the Mississippi River, crashing into the town's lock and dam system. Fox 9's Bab Santos was in Buffalo County today, where onlookers watched as officials tried to get that boat free. Saturday night was a long night here in Alma after a boat spun around in the high waters of the Mississippi before crashing into the lock and dam. That's not something you see every day. Not here. The Buffalo County Sheriff says no one was hurt in the collision and everyone on board was able to get off safely soon after. But the close call was the talk of the town on Sunday with plenty of pictures to show how messy it all was. Something like this happens in your little small town, everybody knows about it. Derek Bartell was down by the water when the sun came up, watching a dozen people running around on top of the dam, trying to figure out how to remove the boat. One, two, I think there was three barges pulling it out. And Derek shot this video as they worked together. How did he end up over there in the first place? The chief of Lock and Dam 4 believes things got out of hand because of the strong flow of high waters this spring. After the crash, crews turned off power on board the Susan J. Gunlatch, which carries petroleum and is operated by the Canal Barge Company. Glad no one was injured and doesn't look like no fuel was spilt or anything. Now the Coast Guard is inspecting the barge for damage and to figure out exactly how this might have happened. In Alma, Bab Santos, Fox 9.